Greetings, everybody. Welcome back to Papa Bear's Kitchen, or maybe welcome me back to Papa Bear's Kitchen. Um, I decided to make a video today and uh, kind of get out of uh, my slump. My previous video was kind of a downer, and uh, I apologize for that. I'm going to go ahead and take it down, and I do appreciate all your kind words and support. And, uh, you know, we're dealing with uh, things pretty nicely, pretty well, I guess, uh, considering, um, you know, the loss of a loved one is never easy. But, you know, there comes a time when you, ha when you do get over it. You have to get over it. Um, today, I... Uh, well, from one of my jobs, uh, they, they sent me a gift card from for Walmart. So I went down and got some spare ribs. And uh, the other day, we were doing some shopping. My older son and I, and we uh, met up with um, one of their friends from a, couple, a few years ago. And uh, he didn't know that I had a YouTube channel with cooking. So we went through and he saw one of the recipes that he wanted to try. So he grabbed the ingredients right away and uh, he was going to make that for his family later that day. <laughs> so that was pretty cool. Um, for new new viewers, welcome to my channel, Papa Bear's Kitchen. And uh, if you go through and look at the videos, it's usually very simple stuff that uh, beginner cooks. Um even experienced cooks, if you if you're strapped for time, if you're on a really tight budget, uh, this is the channel for you. But uh, today I'm making spare ribs, and just as an experiment, I cooked both of them in one of the bags, the oven bags, and these are um, uh, oven bags for turkey, turkey size, and you get three bags for like a couple of bucks but uh these work really really well and let's see for the test to see if the ribs are ready what i usually do is pull one of the ribs let me, see, let me give this a cut real quick pull one of the ribs there you go look at that and this has been on the griddle here for about an hour. And I've put the seasoning on, <coughs> just seasoned salt, garlic, and onion. And I put it in the bag, tied it with just a little little gap for the uh, steam to escape. But um, that's ready. It's ready to eat. Uh, my younger son is out on an errand. And I told him, well, we'll save him, try to save him some. But... <laughs> Uh, sometimes that works out, sometimes not. And um, my older son is here, so that's great. Um, we're probably going to eat pretty soon. But like I said, um, I'm back. I'm back. And we'll have some good cooking tips for you. Simple recipes, easy to do, not expensive. And um, just some really great stuff. But... Um, Thank you for all your support, and uh, I know there's some of you, I usually watch your videos and stuff and try to leave a comment and a, and a thumbs up and stuff like that. I've really kind of just been staying away from the internet for a while, uh, just doing a lot of reading and um, uh, trying to get my family uh, back on track, and um, uh you know, being supportive of them and um, I I guess that's it. I can't think of anything else to say. I'm usually real talkative. But um, spare ribs and whoops, I was going to turn it over. That bone just came right out. Spare ribs in about an hour in an oven bag on a griddle set to high heat, 400 degrees. These bones are just falling out of here. That's ready to eat. Look at that. Yummers. Wiggle it out. Anyway, um, so stay tuned. Like, share, subscribe. 
If you're new to the channel, if you're new to watching, if you can subscribe, that'd be great. Uh, I'm not here to be rich and famous or whatever. Just trying to share some good recipes and on a budget and simple to do. So thank you so much and I'll talk to you later. Bye.